All right, all right, all right. Hello there. How we doing? Just gonna uh, need a sec to like get mentally prepared. Woke up a little bit late this morning, so getting off to a slow start, but we are here now. So let us get going. I don't have a perfect memory of where we last left off with this little game, but nonetheless, let's have some fun. Or at least try to, anyway. Is everybody ready? Everyone! Let's do this. Do your best. This one's mine. At least we're not, like, starting on a cutscene, I will say. I have a bit of time here to let people flood in, but... Mostly just trying to wake myself up a bit, some combat. up eventually. Door. I don't like doors. That, that, the doors mean progression. I don't want to do progression if I haven't explored yet. Oh, well, look who it is. It's a dork. Are we sure this door's not opening? Yeah. I should have done any other attack. Whoops. Hi. Feed another quest. Grab some rough skin here. Oh, we got an enemy. Of course, I have to be the target right now. Deez them. I'm out. Damn it. I didn't mean to interact with this dude, but here we are. progress. Alright, so that's still closed. There's not much we can do there. Just took out a big enemy. Story progression is that way. So what if we go this way? And collect whatever items we can. Such as knee kneecap rocks. Uh, okay. We're looking on the skill tree. Pretty good, pretty good. All right. Uh, can we level up any arts right now? Let's see. Uh, damage from behind, maybe not, but let's level up our hidden thorn. We'll save up some extra. Up that so that he can block better. 
up your light heal shadow eye reduces aggro and increases physical arts damage could be good Right, and then we'll do a little bit of the Collectopedia right now, since we're sitting on it. Take all. See no reason not to deal with this. And then we'll do a little bit of equipment upgrading. Do attack plus. Do we have any do the bouncer knives? So then we'll just put the attack plus on that. Alright, she has the best hat right now. Best armor. Better gauntlets. We'll leave that alone for now. Alright, so that's that for her items, so for them anyway. Let me check. Yeah, I was gonna say. They have to have some better items too. Currently got the best that I can get him. You can wear the battle armor because it's slightly better. And then you're currently wearing middle gauntlets, so I can put you wearing craft gauntlets as well. And then you can wear some messenger shoes. There. And then of course. You're stuck with the chunk sword. Big oof right there. But it is what it is. So not much I can do. You're running with a nine top. Let's put you with the middle armor. Hmm. You're running with these colony cuffs. Let's get you the middle gauntlets. That's the best I could do for you. You're currently wearing... Yeah, that's all I can really do for you. All right, upgrade's done. Let's move along. Is everybody ready? Let me out of I'm ready. Yeah. Yeah. Bring me on. Get rid of you as soon as I can. Who else wants some? Cool. Let's keep this up. Is everybody ready? I'm ready. Let me out. Oh, okay. We win. Let's not lose our heads, though. Piece of cake. I'm getting back into the swing of things because, you know, I hadn't touched this game in a couple days. Nice to understand what I'm doing again. Gotta be useful. Eventually. Level up. Alright. Cutscene, I assume. Nope. Okay. In this place. It's very pretty. Gotta make sure I do a little bit of exploring first before I uh, get too far. Item collection is important. And also heart to heart. I didn't see it at first. Can't view it yet, but doesn't mean it's not I could play later. Right here. Thanks for the help, Shulk. I'll start collecting them up. You two hold on a sec. All right, if I must. 
It's full of ether cylinders. Hey, why do we have to come all the way here to get them? Isn't there an ether cylinder fueling station in the colony? Well, refining the ether takes a long time down there. And sometimes cylinderization fails. Mm. And there are so many cylinders here for us already. It's more reliable than making them ourselves. Right. And Colony 9's anti-air batteries and mobile artillery are standardized for these cylinders. So they can be used straight away. Mm. I see. You know, this place is in good condition considering it's ancient. It might be that there's some form of technology being used to preserve it. Potentially. It's a shame we don't understand its secret. Shulk? But I'll solve it one day and show you. <laughs> if it's just technology that someone created in the past, it's not incomprehensible. We'll come to understand it one day. Fair enough. Don't go trying too hard. We can come and get ether cylinders whenever we need them. Besides, it's a good place for defense force training. Yeah, so good that you didn't even want to come here without Shulk to back you up. Anyway, did you collect the cylinders? I mean, yeah. Yep, all done. Thanks. Just come by yourself from now on. Shh, be quiet. Well, it's always good to have backup. <sighs> Are they Mecco? I don't know. But it looks like we'll have to destroy them. If we can. In that case, just leave them to me. Oh. Switching attack targets. Issuing commands to the party. Okay. Oh yes, bleed. Useful on this one enemy. really like our vibe. I like that line. That's good. Look at that. We took him out. Fiora, are you okay? I'm fine. How about you? I'm all right. Thanks to you and Ryan. Huh? What on Bionis were those? I've never seen anything like them. Could they have been Mekon? No. I think they were something left by the civilization that built this vehicle. They didn't seem like Mekon to me. But why did they only show up now? I don't know. <laughs> but they were probably Good to, know. to protect this place. They might have been activated in response to something. God, it's gonna be like Ryuji's for real. Us. Please, let's go back. I don't want to be here anymore. Me neither. And we've already got the ether cylinders. Huh? What's going on? Listen, what is that? That sound. <laughs> oh? Is there more of them? In the sky. Oh no. Oh, oh, it's a... This can't be. No way. Oh god. You would think so. Could that defense mechanism have responded to the Mekon? Let's get back to the colony. Come on. Yeah, I think that there might be some connection there. Just a little bit. Hey, this siren, it sounds different. Yeah, isn't this siren too? It can't be. Uh-oh. One large Mekon! Ten carriers! And an unknown number of units emerging from the carriers! You idiots! Why didn't you see this lot until they were right on top of us? But sir, we thought the Mekon had all been wiped out! Ah! Oi! What's happening? Respond! 
Dude, really? Assemble everyone who can fight. Evacuate the civilians to the shelter. Get a move yes, on! Sir. Fire at will! We got it! That's no, what you think. Wait. Oh god. What type of mech on is that? I've never seen one like it. You slackers fire! Shoot it down! Oh boy. No, no, stop. Whatever you're thinking, don't. Do they genuinely want me to... I don't think this is what the game wants from me, but I'm doing it anyway. Damn. No, that was exactly what they wanted. Shit. I wasn't expecting to survive that, I'm gonna be honest. Had to finish up a quest real quick. There's more out in the- there's enemies out in the water I need to take care of, but I don't have the fight. Are we even able to fight in the water? No, I don't think so. I'm gonna have to just stop the battle. Gotta get some stuff real quick. Enemies on land. There we go. I'm focusing. Just knew I had a little bit extra that needed to be done. Break it. There we are. Take care of it. Just gonna make sure I'm taking care of uh, quests, getting those rewards. Do I actually have a quest for this, or is it just saying I have one? Don't think I actually had a quest for that one. 
Or if I did, it was an already completed quest. Oh, yes. No, this is the best plan. At least I think so. We don't seem to be on a time limit. Alright. Oh. Time to focus. And actually complete, you know, the task at hand. <laughs> In we go. See if I can even actually fight these things. Oh no. Oh. Oh, God. Ugh. I don't like that. Nope. Yeah, a little bit. Heads up, Ryan. Well, there goes my main party member. Gotta fix this real quick. The attacking from the side would be nice to upgrade. And then we'll upgrade his war swing. Why not? Take a sec. Double check equipment while I'm sitting here. Alright. This is what we're going with. Inflict topple before attacking a mech on. Anyone can deal damage to a mech on if it's suffering topple. Topple arts, inflict topple, break arts, inflict break. Inflict break before topple. Use turn strike to inflict break. And then wild down to affect inflict topple. Okay. break. Don't think I have a thing to inflict topple, so I'm kind of screwed here. Oh, right. Just my aggro real quick. Come on, you gotta do the wild down, please. I don't think I have control here. There we go, finally. Love relying on my party members. Yeah, that's one. We've disabled it, but only for now. It'll reactivate soon. Where's Dunban? He's gone. 
I can't find him anywhere. I know what? where he is. He ain't fit enough to face these things. Ryan, let's get to the lab. The lab? Of course. The Monado's there. Yep. Exactly. The Monado can take out Mechon. Fix this. Party. There we go. Top check her arts because I feel like. Yeah. Dazing. I mean, that gives a break, but there's not much that I can do there. Running away is a valid tactic. Fair enough. Okay. This is the path I'm taking. I know they see me, but there's not much I can do against them, so... Where's the rest of the party? Okay. Shulk, hurry then! Please. Yeah, they're dead. Men, don't give up this position. Run and I'll kill you myself. Yeah, these are gonna live that long. <laughs> what, what the hell are you? A mech on with a face. <laughs> yes. Grin at me, will you? Yes. Ooh. This looks like fun. Oh god, it has wings. Off it goes. And in we have to go. So. Come on. Just turned auto run on for my thumb's sake. Okay, fine. We'll just keep moving. Excuse me. Oh god. The colonel. The guys. I'm going to destroy every last one of those damn mechon. How? Shulk, the entrance. Mm -hmm. No. We'll never get in there now. Wait. Let me think here. It's always another way in. Ryan, Biora, there's still the mobile artillery. Right. If we recharge it with those ether cylinders we collected, we can blast our way in. True. It's in the residential district. Great. All right. This is it. Time to avenge the Colonel and the boys. Fair enough. Let's get going. <laughs> Excuse me. Oh. I haven't had a chance to like actually get caffeine yet. What the? Shulk, more from behind. Right. Looks like you and I will have to cut a path through them. Looks like it. Fiora, Ryan and I will open up a path. Then you can run through. You two can't do this by yourselves. I want to fight as well. Get through. We'll be right behind you. But Shulk... A year ago, Dunban and the Defense Force fought hard to protect the colony and all of us Homs. Now it's our turn to repay them. Please, Viora. Uh, <clears throat> Shulk... Ryan... Don't look so worried. We'll just get rid of these ones. 
Schultz won't get a scratch. Oh, yeah. Okay, I believe you. Go now, Fiora. All right, I guess it's uh, our job. Huh? You take care too. Of course. Looks like she trusts me after all. Mm. I told you. All right, one last party adjustment. Again. Um, one last double check of the arts. Cool. Rhyme time. Are we able to run from this? Or do we have to take them out? I think we have to fight. So we're gonna do it. This is just gonna be the fight now. The fact that I can't really do anything. here. Do your thing, please. I understand that you don't really... There it is. Let's back up again. Need to do its thing. There we go. Eventually, I get there. You were never cut out for this stuff. You go. I'll take care of things here. Fair enough. You're too out of breath to persuade me. Tell me about it. Oh! Too close. Get out of here! Short cut is stupid! Hold on! Oh! Oh no. Sorry I kept you waiting. Dumb back! Whoa, yeah! The Monado! So this is why you weren't at home. I thought so. Yeah, it's this is what I was waiting to see. Ready, lads. I was gonna say, yeah, I guess I'll take Dunban. Okay, I only have control over these two uh, abilities, so... So, are we actually gonna fight? Nice one, Dunban! You didn't waste any time on them mechon. Shulk, where's Fiora? The residential district. We said we'd meet her there. Uh-huh. 
Looks like we'll have to take the long way round. All right. Then we cut through the commercial district. Yes. This is the plan? This is the plan. All right, we're doing this. Oh. Wish I knew what she was doing. Alright. Take care of these fuckers while we're going. There we go. Take care of the uh, enemies way easier like this. Gotta collect items. Chant. There we go. Make it possible to actually fight these things. As I say, I don't want to waste the abilities if they're uh, going to get taken out really quickly. So I can use it for someone like this. Oh hey, look who it is! It's the other cutie. How we doing? Come on, let's make this fight quick, please. Thank you. I will get cocky if I want to get cocky. Thank you very much, video game. Alright, let's take care of one, at least one more big one. On. There we go. Ah, I see. Fair enough. I can't go in here. No, I cannot. So. Well done. Dunban! You can't take any more of the Monado! But I must! I don't have a choice! Ryan's right. You can't go on like this. Shulk! Dunban. Hey! Shulk, no! You'll never be able to wield the power of the Monado. It's my turn! Shulk, no! It'll kill you! Ugh, this looks painful. Ooh. Nice. What's happening? We're in slow mo. Don't you feel it? Ah! 
Shulk All right. Is awesome. Shulk is pretty awesome. How could this be? Shulk is using the Monado. Yes, he's able to do What's stuff. That? Shulk, more company. Ryan. Right. Ryan. Ooh, that sounds like good food. I got your back. Shulk, do you feel all right? I'm okay. But there was something strange. Just now, it was as if I could see into the future. Oh. Is this another power of the Monado? See into the future? What are you saying? Uh, are you certain? Shulk. Yes. Yeah. I see. I remember Dixon saying that the Monado had a hidden power. I feel like it has more hidden powers, but yeah. What? Uh, so much as I like playing Fiora, I feel like I have to have the one with the Monado now. Once the time fell. Continue this game. Yes. I shall. I have intentions to continue. So Monado Arts. And then I have my usual stuff. I'm gonna up my Shadow Eye. Okay. Now Dunban has regular abilities. Very good. Alright, let's move on. Activate Monado, press A to switch. Okay, okay. So that's how I can do stuff like uh, enchant and things like that. Got it. Okay, this makes sense. I'm gonna give them a hand while my abilities are loading up. I do Sagro. Alright. Making sure everyone's able to attack. Yes, thank you for uh, popping in. It's always good to see you here soon. He spams in chance that you can attack with whoever you're controlling. I mean, yeah, but like, I kind of just want to be, I want to have the overpowered really cool sword, so you know. But then again, I mean, this is a, I don't get too much, uh, what do you call it? I tend not to get, uh, dysphoria from playing video games, surprisingly, unless it's something where I'm creating a character. So, usually I'm fine. Alright, backslash. I oh, know, I'm not against the idea of using a different party member, it's just the idea of wanting to have cool badass sword. Let's make sure that I'm able to do a thing. Okay, next one. I think I'm going in the wrong direction, aren't I? I just realized. Alright, once I take this one out, I will, uh... Oh, I messed that up. Which way am I actually supposed to be going? This way. There we go. Lesson. Aggro on me. Make it so I can actually hit them from the back. 
Yeah, uh, the, 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 the line keeps getting a little bit screwy for me when I try to... I, I keep getting it mixed up, like, the exact directions, so that's part of the issue I've been having with it. Uh, it's targeting me again. All right. It's just one of those things you have to get like get used to when you're playing a game you've never played before with unique mechanics. So yeah. And these are definitely unique mechanics. Very fun, but also very unique. Who needs chain attacks? Not a bit. I mean, I have the chain attack, but I keep not having a reason to use it because I take them out pretty fast. Oh yeah, no, that is something I actually kind of like about this, is that everyone seems to have their own special, like, mechanics to them. Definitely creates a, uh, unique... ...experience. All right, let's do this. Let's do this for real this time. Attack from behind. Wild down. And... Nice. Grab this. I see something on the stairs. Hmm. Gotcha. We will have to see when I get there, though. Ooh, it's a big dude. Hmm. Okay. Also, the fact that you said she already tempts me. I'm gonna be honest. Get behind it, get behind it. There we go. Don't worry, we got this. Get rid of that. Uh, the fact that I'm not doing anything to it. Uh, plot armor. <laughs> Just the whole finger! I love it. Should cut through Mekon with ease. Yeah, well, this is something different, I have a feeling. What, what is that light? Other Mekon don't have that. Could... Could that light be why the Monado has no effect? Potentially. Oh! Stay back. I'll take it from here. Just a little bit. No, you can't take a little, little slip up there. That's okay. Whenever I hear she, I'm already all low. Oh god. Okay. I have not been playing enough Gundam Evolution to be ready for this. 
Oh no. What? What did I just? You just? Yeah, you just saw. You saw her. I won't let you hurt any more people. We will save Colony Nine. Oh! There goes your gun. Well, and more guns. Why would you do this? Oh, I mean, if it works. Oh! She survived. I will say that. But so did it. I can give you a number of reasons why. Oh, I see. Uh huh. Okay. Yeah, okay. Thank you. Because apparently I don't have it active on my thing. Yeah, it says I should be able to use moderated actions. Apparently not. I'll kill you! Nice. There's no effect on Mechon with faces. You'll have to inflict break and topple before you'll be able to damage it. It may be difficult to inflict break on larger monsters, but it is almost always possible if part of a chain attack. Gotcha. Try this. Yeah. It did kind of make me space a little bit. Like, that was a pretty good chain. Wish it had done something, but Oh, it's just the Monado? Oh. Interesting. I just thought it was toppled already so I could use it. It's fine, but good to know. And now the aftermath. Fiora. Hmm. Oh. Ah, the breeze feels so good. Yeah. I'd forgotten what it feels like. I never thought it could be so quiet here. You're spending too much time with Ryan. You're getting used to all the noise he makes. <laughs> yeah, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's so peaceful. You know, Shulk. 
I hope every day can be like this always. Oh. Oh, I just want to give him a big hug right now. Hey. Have you been to see Dumban? Mm. Yeah. I just can't do it. You got more guts than me. Not at all. It was him that consoled me. Oh. <laughs> I guess that's the type of guy he is. Yeah. Even without the Monado, he's the strongest person I know. Uh, Shulk, how are you holding up? I'm fine, but you... I will shed no tears. Huh? A year ago, mm -hmm. I felt the same sense of deep loss that I do now. The Battle of Sword Valley. After that battle, many of my friends did not make it home. While I was being brought here on that stretcher, they were all I thought about. <sighs> but I decided I would not cry. Everyone who died in that war had something they wanted to protect. <laughs> Family, friends, loved ones, their home. So they fought to protect them. And we won. <sighs> no matter how painful, no matter how hard, it's nothing to be sad about. I decided that there and then. Dumban. Shulk, Fiora would tell you the same thing. <laughs> She wanted to protect us. Or rather, she wanted to protect you. And you're alive now. So, I will not cry. <laughs> okay. Remember the gift of life that Fiora gave you. And treasure it. I... I can't say that I understand. But... I hope to. Someday. That is all I ask. Hmm. Believe me, I'm always just trying to understand. Treasure the gift of life that Fiora gave you. He's one of a kind, that Dunban. I've made a decision. Huh? My purpose in life. I will pursue that faced Mekon. Shulk. Mm -hmm. They attacked our colony. Killed Fiora. I will find that Mekon. Find it and destroy it. Destroy them all. <laughs> mm -hmm. What are you laughing at? Sorry, sorry. It's just a bit weird. I never thought you'd be the one to say it. <laughs> so you agree? Of course, man. <laughs> I'm just surprised you came out with it first. You thought I'd try and talk you out of it. That's not what Fiora would want. That sound right? Yeah. <laughs> Something like that. I thought you'd give me a hard time. In my head, there are two versions of me. One of them is saying that. It's telling me, listen to what Dunban said. What about the other one? There are two wolves in you. It keeps shouting, make them pay. Destroy every single one of them. And it won't stop getting louder. That doesn't sound like you. Sure, it ain't my voice in there. <laughs> Might be. It's a bit of a loud mouth. Oof. There you go then. <laughs> <sighs> so... When are we heading off? Right now. Perfect. Yeah. 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 <laughs> he just straight up right has there. the Monado now. Yeah. Good to know that he has control. Ourselves, boys. As soon as this heals, I'll be right behind you. <laughs> and then we will seize our destiny. Together. <laughs> yeah, no, that does hit pretty, pretty hard. 
15 years ago. But yes, there are two wolves inside of you. One goes honk shoo, honk shoo, and the other goes honk me 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 me. Just wanted to get that joke out of my head. <laughs> It was either that one or the one is gay, the other one is gay. You are gay. Yes, yes it is. It's wonderful. That is a... That is a fluffy coat. Interesting. Getting his beauty sleep, I guess. Mm -hmm. Wish I had gotten more sleep. Just a little bit. It's all very well going after that metal faced Mechon. But shouldn't we have some kind of plan? <laughs> no. How about checking out Colony 6? Colony 6? The only other Homs colony left. Colony 6 is on the way to Sword Valley, where there's supposed to be a Mechon base. If that's where they came from, maybe the people in Colony 6 saw something. Hmm. Good point. They might even know something about that metal faced Mechon. So. We go past the Magmel Ruins and up through Tefra Cave. Then we should arrive at the Bionis Knee. Yeah. And if we can get to the Knee, it ain't far to Colony 6, right? Sounds like a plan. Okay. Let's head to Colony 6. Let's do this. Yeah, this looks good. Make Ether Gems in the Ether, ether Furnace in Colony 9. Try to the Gem Man. Probably should do that before we get too far out. Deal with the Collectopedia real quick. That is a cool potato. There, it's just the bugs left. We are going to make a quick stop there since the game kind of wants me to do that. We'll go talk to our, our uh, gem man. What is heart to heart and can I even get to it? I don't think I can because it's Dunman's house. Okay. Fair enough. I mean, hey, if you want, if that's how you're gonna do it, go ahead. I mean, I can't really stop you, can I? I would like some biscuits, just a bit. Good day. 
Let's see, collect two rabbit diodes. Can't believe I didn't pick these up earlier. Do I have a Discord? I'm working on it. I, I, I promise I'm working on it because I've been asked that before. And uh, not yet. Because I have, I'm having trouble putting one together fully. Because I am not good at that kind of stuff. But I do intend to have one soon. Or if you're just asking for, like, username, I, uh, that, that I can also... Uh, I do have that, at least. Uh, but yeah, uh, probably give it another week, maybe not even a week, and I'll probably have one fully put together. I just need to get the rest of stuff, like a couple of small things set up on it, really. Look at that. Quick. Quick completion. Yeah. Does Twitch still have a private messaging thing? Because I was going to say if we wanted to... If you did want to... Add me on Discord, I could do... That... And again, it doesn't matter too much. Where's the gem man again? I think I already passed him. I think they got rid of that, though. Craft your own gems. Does it? Oh, yeah, it does have whispers, doesn't it? How to create an ether gem. It's gonna, like, kind of... See what I can do here. What? Can I uh. This is like this is like crafting personas. I understand somewhat what I need to do, but also have no clue how to do it. Because the effect has reached 100% purity. Strong bonus. Qualities go stronger with a strong flame. Fever plus gets into a fever easily when crafting. Okay. I've got it. I am all over that. To me. To you. Woo. To me. Alrighty. Alright. Good job. Wish I knew. I, I should have. Yeah, I have... I kind of understand what's going on. I, I should have just read the whole thing, but I was also trying not to waste too much time on reading it. Uh, just, just go to all. I'll find it eventually again. Here we go, gem crafting tutorial. You shall recommend it to find materials quickly. Okay. That's useful. Two members increases, they'll make better gems. Okay. So you select materials. Only either crystals of the same rank can be put into the furnace at the same time. Yeah. When it exceeds 100%, an ether gem back quality will be formed. Excuse me. Put crystals of natural matching qualities into the furnace. If the total strength of the quality you were aiming for exceeds 
A to confirm the crystals. Crafting is carried out by two party members. The shooter and the engineer. When selected, the abilities of each party member will be shown. Oops. Back up. Yeah, okay. Shooter will shoot several times during crafting. Each time you craft, the abilities of your party members will kick in. Results will depend on the abilities of the two party members. Okay. I don't know if I will mess with that too much, but we'll see. So I'm just going to do a quick double check on and do anything there. So let's see. What do we have? Strength up. Let's use both of them, because why not? Uh, what do you currently have equipped? You have middle armor on. Let's put on the front armor with the HP up on it. Very nice. Craft gauntlets. Court leggings. Gotta give you the best shit. Only the best for, for my main character. Quick step. And then, can I just... Brain is, brain is moving slowly, hold on. Uh, Soldier Pike looks like the best one here. Give him a nice strength up, middle gear. Put that on you. Currently have that on, let's put that on. Did I say rain instead of rhyme? Yeah, that's about right. It's just one of those days. Lots of agility. There we go. Leveling up Monado Arts. I can't afford to, but eventually I will. Yeah, no, that was unintentional. Just slow brain times. No caffeine, only running on actual brain power. It's miserable. The enemy's weak, but don't drop your guard. Eventually, I'll start buying actual. I'll be able to actually get an energy drink again. Actually, what time is it? It's 2.45? Yeah. Might end early and go out and actually... I don't have time to go shopping, but I'll have time to go get lunch. I woke up at around 11.30 today, my time, which is... It's uh, almost 3 o'clock now, so... If that tells you anything. I've only been up for about, like, 2 or 3 hours now. I'm not good with, uh... I don't have a good sleep schedule. Plus, uh, some dorks were convincing me to play Pokemon last night. But no, it's a mix of waking up, like, right before wanting to stream, planning to stream, like an hour before planning to stream. And also the fact that I have a caffeine addiction, 
that has not been satiated in like a week. I should say correctly satiated in like a week because I do drink caffeine when I can. A caffeine addiction, as in like, I enjoy caffeinated beverages such as Mountain Dew and like Monster and that kind of shit. Not like an actual addiction, per se. More of a... I really hope that it was... I don't think I'm addicted to anything else. Come on, let me get to the side of you. Okay, fine. We're gonna do this. But no, I have not been doing a good job at getting caffeine into my body on a regular basis because I need to get better at saving my money, honestly. That, that's like the major problem I have right now is like not overspending. I almost just made a vast overspending last night, but I can't, I couldn't afford it in the first place. So I was like, I managed to stop myself from spending $100 on stuff that I want but don't need. It's fine. I don't need Scott the Waz clue. I already have Scott the Waz Monopoly. But also, Clue is like one of my favorite board games, so like, it does make me a little bit sad. Yeah, no, for the charity thing this year, you did um, Clue instead, uh, Clue, which, like I said, Clue is like my favorite, like, basic bitch board game to play. My favorite actual board game to play, I think, would have to be. Uh, I actually don't know. I haven't thought too hard about this. Maybe something like, um, I like Betrayal a lot. Betrayal at House on the Hill. But also the, like, not actually, but technically precursor to the existence of Among Us before I knew about it is a game called Secret Hitler that works a lot the same way. It is so much fun to play with a group of people. We recently, for a Friendsgiving thing, finally had like a whole group of 10 people to play it. It was so much fun. Am I going the wrong way? No, okay, it just didn't update yet. Yes, very sus. Keep thinking I'm going to be able to jump up easily. My jump's not as high as I think it is. Come on. There we go. Just want I just want random items that I can collect. Thank you. Let's see. Can I do anything here? Heart to heart. There we go. Every time we come here, it brings back memories. Same for you, right? Yep. Been through a lot together, you and me. I'm not doing an Australian accent or New Zealand accent. I'm not that good at that. I can barely do a British accent, if at all. You know, that one time? Are they British? It sounds... Fa They're all British? Okay, it sounded vaguely Australian to me. I don't know why. I feel like I just heard somewhere that they're that they were Australian voices. And just like agreed to it. What do you mean I'm remembering it wrong? 
Not wrong, exactly, but that's not the important part, man. Think harder. Remember why he got angry with us? Of course I do. You know what? Fair enough. Oh yeah, we made Fiora cry. That is sad. The one who was reminding me. If I think back, weren't we having a massive argument? Number of times we fought. Finger. Kind of makes you smile, though. Where for that fight, I don't think we'd be mates. Oh yeah, definitely British. No, I'm pretty sure it was just the fact that I heard somewhere that Shulk had, had an Australian accent, and then my brain just runs with that. I don't know where I heard it. It was before I even knew about this game well, so it was probably when I used to, uh, when I played Smash Brothers once in a while. And it just kind of stuck. Don't know, though, honestly. That's funny. No, I still- yeah, like I said, I have no idea where that- where the thought came from. I just know it's there, in my head. Because... I am bad with accents, it's true, but... Also, I have a- I feel like it- that- like, there's gotta be the other- like, the other part of it. That I just don't know where I heard it, though, is the problem. Alright, let's start this off. Let's see if I can do this fight this time. I should have saved first. Why didn't I save? That was very close, my friend. Heal myself up. Lessen their any reason to look at me meter. Oh, I might be able to actually do this. There we go. And let's take care of the rest of these just for funsies. Because they're just kind of sitting here at this point. Oh yeah? This won't take long at all. Genuinely. I work fast. The enemy's weak, but don't drop your guard. This won't take long. The enemy's weak, but don't drop your guard. Just, just, just take them all out. All right, let's see if we can end this in the same spot we began this. dealing with me, so I get to deal with you. Break. Come on, come on. Oh, we ain't done here yet.
But now that's what I get for not doing any research into a game before I uh, actually played it. Not knowing anything about it. Alright, time to clear this room and then we will uh, probably end it off here, but only because I was planning to get off around 3.30 anyways and then giving myself that extra half an hour to go get food would be nice before uh, my D&D game tonight. Hmm. Fair enough. But yeah, we'll, uh, we'll probably, uh, yeah, we'll, we'll end in the same place we began. I feel like that makes the most, it doesn't make sense, but we're going to do it anyways. So there we go. Ended back in the Tefra cave in the exact same spot. No Fiora. Tear. Tear going down the side of my face. Just a little bit. Okay, well, anyway. Unless I've got a thing in chat, so... Got it. Yeah, I will, um, I will, uh, deal with that as soon as possible. Thank you, though, for reminding me about it, needing to get it done. Uh, but, yeah, I will probably... I, I will try to get it up by Monday, so that, uh, when I'm streaming, I'll, it'll just be down in the panels, and I can just, uh, yeah. But, I think this is where I'm gonna end it for the sake of time, and the sake of me needing to eat food like a normal human being. Okay, yeah, I, I can do that too, it's just, um, time. Time is fun. But anyway, we're gonna start up our little, uh, our nice little, uh, lo-fi tunes to lead us out. Thank you all for joining. I hope you had as much fun as I did playing this game. And by fun, I mean grief-stricken fun. But, you know, nonetheless, still fun. But yeah, uh, I will get on that as soon as possible. Uh, but yeah... So thank you so much for joining me, and I hope you have a good rest of your day. <laughs> have a good one. <laughs>